Hello, and welcome to the first installment of the Scandinavian Perspective on, here on the Progressive Army and the Benjamin Diction Show. My name is Nis Vincent Peterson, and I'm joined today by the great team at the Progressive Army. Benjamin Dixon is manning the phones, and behind the scenes we have Kelly and David and Dalton doing live production and with you in the chat, including many others who are making these shows possible. This is the first installment of the Scandinavian Perspective, and one of many, I hope, for the future as the Progressive Army keeps growing. A little about me, uh, as many of you might pick up on my accent, I'm not a natural-born U.S. citizen. Uh, I was born and raised in Denmark. I recently moved to the States to help uh, Bernie get elected to help solidify the movement that is happening here, not just uh, because the U.S. is all important, but because of the Western Spring that is taking place, not just in the States, but in all of the Western countries. In Greece, in Spain, we're slowly starting to see things happening in the Scandinavian countries, in Germany. Unfortunately, as here in the US, there are also right-wing movements pulling the other way. Uh, so it is a fight. It is a political fight as of now, but it may very well turn into more of a brawl as we are going to examine uh, here at the Scandinavian Perspective. So what this show is going to be about is very simply put to examine this uh, Western Spring to see what is going on today and see it in the context of the past. Now, there are many people who are calling Bernie Sanders a, a socialist. There are many people calling him a communist. And there are people calling uh, Trump and his supporters fascists. And there is, for the most part, no truth to much of it. So what I want to offer up is perspective to actually, instead of simply blatantly go, okay, we have uh, Trump, he's the new Hitler. Instead of simply doing that, that all that, that does is shut down the conversation. You have stated something very extreme, and anyone and everyone who would even in the slightest sympathize with you or might agree somewhat with the nuances of your points just stopped listening, because all they heard was Hitler. So what we're going to do is we're going to break it down, we're going to tear it up, and we're going to examine it. Today's show... Will